<laughs> so, anyway, we're on number three, and we're here talking to you about the day my man banged a girl in his eye. Oh. Merry Christmas. Hey, yeah. And if you haven't tuned in for the first two, listen, guys, welcome to the Vlogmas Story Times, okay? Where I'm talking about the second worst school in the whole of the country, B. Okay, like you have to understand this country, this school was so bad. You know what I'm saying? It makes me wonder how I made it through. Okay, okay I need you to understand, I'm in year seven now, okay? What I want to even put this here, John Paul II, like I said, is in Princess Way, baby. I come from Battersea. But what you have to understand about London, especially South London, right? When you're young, okay, there's no such thing as girls and boys, okay? When it comes to disrespect, do you get me? Like, a girl could bang you in your face. You might, you, can't, you might not have to say anything because her brother, once her brother gets involved, your life is done. Your life in oh. existence on earth is done. So you take the bang and you hold it, you get me? Now, Bruh. if you've got older brothers and you can't back it, then you're about it. If you're crazy, you, and you're about it, you can back it. You get what I'm saying? So understand yeah like when it comes to boys and girls okay like that's why sometimes when i look at certain situations what happened on the thing and i'm like a girl's banging a guy in the face she can hold a bang then because you can okay. tell me you can bang a guy in the face and they're not expecting to bang you back because you're a female well if you're a female you should never bang him in the first place listen you know what time it is so back to john paul too anyway so listen i'm in school year seven times all right and yeah we've seen a couple wavy things happening and stuff like that you got what i'm saying there's been a couple fights here and there and you know when fights happen everyone's like oh and then you just see people running just Hey, fight them, fight, 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 fight them. Everyone's running fight. to see what's happening in the back playground. Before you know, you got a. And do you want something beautiful? How do we manage to get a perfect circle? I don't know. I still don't understand to this day how we make a perfect circle so people can do their fight. <laughs> it's mad. <laughs> but anyway, so we come around and then, you know, people get into a circle and say, ooh. And then when people don't fight and people just chat and breeze and they're not really backing it, they're like, bruv, you're wasting my time. Like, we Finish come here him. running for you, man, to scrap, man. Yeah, and you're here talking, talking trash to each other. You can do that elsewhere. But the matter thing, I've been in a situation where, as well, I remember in school as well, um, when I was, I was um, there was going to be a fight between me and another person. But there really wasn't going to be a fight, okay? It was just going to be a conversation which was going to get very heated, but no fists were going to get fist to cuffs. You know what I'm saying? I, was, I wasn't ready to do this. I, I told you, I was a little fat kid. I really ain't, I ain't about this duking life. You know what I'm saying? I'm about picking you up and dashing you. But that can hurt you. Test you your be damaged. I'm not about that life either. So, we must have been on the back playground or whatever. And it, it got a bit heated. Da, da, da. Before you knew it, bare people rushing around. And I was like, looking around at everybody like, yo, blood. <laughs> Is this not what you want? Are you not entertained? You know what I mean? No, but like real talk, I was like, why is everyone screwing around? I'm like, I'm, this is not this is not going to be a 50 cuffs, okay? I um, just wanted to have a conversation which is going to get eaten and that's it and leave it at that because I'm really not the fighting type, all right? But everyone are gathered around you. So sometimes in school, people get pressured into a fight, you know, because they got a reputation to hold. Do you get me? So when the crowd come around them, fam, you know this time, when the crowd come around them, now they got like, the pressure's on them. So what are they going to do? Boom, boom. They're going to have to duke. And if they're not strong, really and truly, just open their big mouth, they're gonna get decked. You get me? Bruh. You gotta fight, you gotta scrap, you gotta do what you gotta do, baby. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> I remember one time in our year, let's just call them, call it Lennox and Esther, okay? Random names. Now, what happened was, Esther was running her mouth all day, bro. Like, you look, in our school, you have to understand, like, like I said, boys and girls, listen, there's no real difference apart from that you're, you've got a sexy body. You know what I'm saying? There's no real difference because where we all grow up, we grow up from estates where girls and boys are doing the maddest things. Girls and boys are boy fighting. Do you get me? So when we come to school, it's the same mentality. Like if a, a girl will know her limits, but then sometimes she just wants to step that boundary. You get me? And so Esther was just running her mouth blood. Like, yo, fam, just yapping away, rude boy. Just chicky, 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 chicky all day, son. And L is not really the type to fight, yeah? But he will scrap if he needs to scrap. Do you get me? He's that kind of guy. I, and I never seen L this way. L's one of my cool peoples. I never seen L this way. You get me? So boom, two twos now. Um, Esther's running the mouth, running the mouth, running the mouth. Comes now to the black playground because you know, understand the black playground for the boys. Yeah, it's our kick spot. So L, myself, and others we're gonna kick football. Yeah? And we used to have like African versus Caribbean matches. <laughs> Yo, Af 
African Reds Caribbean Raptors were live! Obviously, Africans won because we're the baddest youths. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Our team was too legendary on the African team. Our team was legendary, blood. Listen, we have players that can dribble, man, and, and dribble them again, and dribble them again, blood, and make you embarrassed, blood. Listen, Jamaicans had some good players, I ain't gonna lie to you. It was many Jamaicans who was holding down for Caribbeans, but. The Caribbeans had some players. So what we used to do, when we used to have the African Caribbean matches, yeah, the girls would come and line up at the back so the Africans will make sure we are coming to do the business. Yeah. If you think your girls are coming to watch, we're coming to do the business. Anyway, so back to the story. Esther's running them out, running them out. Running your mouth all day from 9 o'clock up until lunchtime is now 1.15 So you imagine, we've just entered the back playground, okay? Okay, we've en just literally entered the back playground She's still coming behind him, he's walking now And she's coming behind him, still talking to trash blood Girls don't usually enter the back playground Girls don't usually, not, 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 not that area when we're playing football They don't usually, do you get what I'm saying? So, there's only a few girls that would like the pretty ones, you know what I mean? The ones you have to show off the skills and bang holes, you know what I mean? Anyway, so she's falling behind him, still talking trash and everything. I, I, I believe that she pushed him, innit? She pushed him. So he went forward like that. And he did not hesitate. He's a lefty. Did not hesitate before the left hook came. What? <laughs> My girl. Flawless that victory. was it. One punch. One punch. She just went down to the ground. Crying. What can I say? What can I say? Bro, you've been running your mouth all day, blood. See, most people will say to you, oh, like, that, that, how can a boy punch a girl? Listen, in our time, when we're in year seven, okay, when boys and girls don't really know any better because really and truly, in the ends that we are in, listen, you have to defend yourself at all costs. You can't let your pride, you can't let your reputation, you can't let your name be tarnished by because a girl wants to run her mouth. You will do what you got to do. And you best believe in our school, I've seen too many fights where girls are trying to bang boys and boys are just just having to just collapse them like real talk you get me <laughs> if you were at school you would have you would look at life differently do you get what i'm saying you would look at life differently you know what i'm saying so anyway he just collapsed her blah, blah, blah. <laughs> collapsed her with one punch finished the girl was finished this girl was heavy look the girl was not a small girl she's heavy you know not even fat she's heavy like the body heavy you know what i'm saying so when he punched her bam i just bam i just bam i just said well I mean, what can I do, man? What can we do? She been running her mouth all day, baby. Like, you, what do you want me? To, what do you want him to do? Like, you put a man in an impossible position because you're running your mouth all day. And not only that, pressures. You have to understand. Other men are gonna be like, oh, L, you're gonna take that. You're gonna take that L. Come on, she's just putting you up, fam. Da -da -da. Eventually, the pressure gets to a man, and before you know it, boom. Now they never would have done that to me because I'm really not about that life. That's not the fight I want to talk to you about. No, no, no. See, that fight was tame. That fight there was tame. Let me tell you about a time. I want to call this guy, but Sierra and Denise, okay? Sierra and Denise, okay? Sierra and Denise. Sierra and Denise are in year 11 by the time I'm year seven, okay? I want you to understand, in our school, like I said, there are bad youths and there are bad youths, okay? Now, the bad youths, you can try to mess with, but the bad, bad youths, listen, you mess with them, you're gonna end up dead. Cool. So. Sierra is a bad, bad you. Man, don't give two shelly if you're a teacher or whether you're a gal, Bruh. a mum, a dad, an auntie, a grandma. If you disrespect man, you can get, a, you can hold a bang. You can hold a bang. This is South London for you. Anyway, listen, it's early in the morning. No, this is early at, in the morning, you know. Coming in the morning, yeah. We're coming off the bus of 670B because we were, we've got the second bus. Sierra and Denise are arguing. They're arguing, yeah. And Sierra, like I said, Sierra is the type that don't give a shelle who you are, does not Bruh. give two cents who you are. If you disrespect man, you can hold a bang. I never, ever, ever, like there's elders who I can always try to like be mischievous with, be a little bit rude with. But Sierra? No, 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 no. Sierra will have you see in Tango and make you see unicorns. And then it's be a violation. And then you'll be drinking whiskey by the end. So, Sierra. Yeah. And Denise are arguing. I can't remember. I'm, I'm sure. Yeah. Denise. Look. These things as well. They're always instigated by girls. I don't understand. I don't understand. These are man. And you're instigating the beef. So, 
Denise, uh, Denise obviously knows the kind of guy he is. Everyone knows who he is. Like, everyone knows what kind of type of guy he is. I don't know what he done. He must have run rude. And he just... He told her at the time when he was arguing, shut up, I will bang you. Now, when I hear that, I froze. Look, everyone, fro like, me and my crew, we just froze. We just like... He said... Like, I don't... And we just thought we... We don't want to move because we don't want to be involved in anything. We don't want him to call us over or anything to... Inter you know what I'm saying? Like, you, look, all the sometimes will tell you, listen, come over and tell this girl to shut up because I've told her to shut up, she ain't shutting up. I'll give her the bang. I don't, I, really don't, I don't want to have to be the one that delivers a message, okay? <laughs> I don't want to be the one. I don't want to be the one to deliver a message. Cool. So now, Sierra, obviously, yeah, chatting to, Den chatting, chatting, chatting to Denise. Um, Denise is still running her mouth, saying, talking trash, blood. So what does Sierra do, blood? Now, Sierra's got, a, he normally has a ring on his fist. I didn't know this until I see the connection. So I want you to understand I've never seen a bang. No, I have. I have. I've seen a guy bang a girl like that before. Yeah, only re not long ago. Anyway, so Sierra, yeah, tells her again. Listen, keep talking. I'm gonna bang you in your face, blood. I'm hearing this language and I'm like, oh my god, guys, fight. Let's. Uh, on it, on this occasion, I don't really want to be the one that's ganging and doing the circle thing because Sierra's not the type that fights um, to let you live. So you know. So she's still running her mouth, and then before I knew it. The connection and this is what I heard. It was so bad. The sound, I knew something was broken. Yeah, you have to understand. He banged her, but he connected with the eye so well. When she started screaming, she said, <laughs> "Like I thought hell was coming to us at the time." Yeah, you know I mean, I didn't realize how much the bang was so bad until I started seeing blood, blood at the eye. I said, "Ooh." I said, oh, the girl ran into the office. I said, oh, no, this is not the one that you laugh. You see, so there's some times when people get banged, yeah? You just be laughing like you got banged. <laughs> even the, even the, um, the, um, the L and the Esther, the Lennox and the Esther, I, I laughed, fam, because the bang was like, bam, and she just fell down and it was over, yeah? But on this occasion, the extreme force here, the extremity of force here was too much. And because he had a ring on, when he banged her, the ring connected with the eye and split the eye. Now, I don't know if she's blind. All I remember is that she, when she came in the next few days, she had to have a patch on the eye. Do you get me? So, yeah, there was mad things that happened in that school, man. When you see mad things like that, fam, you, you, you change the way you look at life. Yeah, the elders are crazy, blood. The elders are crazy, blood. Oh. Three episodes. It's not as funny as the other ones. It's more of a serious one. But listen, guys. Yo. Listen, hear your story. Comment down below, let me know what I'm on. Like, how is it for you? Do you see me back? 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 Merry Christmas!